2018, the inaugural High School Pele Award Show was held at Farrington High School Auditorium, the first of its kind in the entire United States. The mission of the High School Pele Awards competition is to recognize and honor creative excellence in the art of advertising and design. A panel of distinguished Hawaii advertising and design professionals awarded 80 entries, winning either a Pele Gold, Silver, Bronze, or Honorable Mention. The Pele Awards partnered with Nella Media Group, who introduced the NMG Scholarship Program. Waipahu High School's Veronica Aquino was awarded the best of show for her Slice Juice Box. Our 2019 High School Pele Awards garnered 350 entries. Hawaii Advertising and Design Professionals awarded 137 entries as award finalists. Here are the entries that our judges chose as our 2019 winners. Hi, my name is Vince Sullivan. I am the Executive Creative Director at MVMP. Uh, some of our clients include Hawaii Tourism, HVCB, uh, First Hawaiian Bank, First Insurance Company of Hawaii, McDonald's, and a bunch of others. Uh, my judge's choice goes to self for packaging. The designer is Connie Wong. She did a really awesome job. Um, when I look at this, I look at the illustration and I think, wow, this is something that just has a lot of personality to it. You know, it doesn't feel like something that you'd find in a stock photo search or a stock illustration search. There's definitely a vibe going on and I love the way she made the uh, women or girls in here look super confident. Um, while they're wearing their mask. I know, you know, I have a wife and she's always wearing a mask and it's uh, pretty scary sometimes, scare my kid. But they look great, they look glamorous and I love the way that she constructed it. I mean, if you look at it and imagining it kind of off the shelf, opening it up and discovering those three different layers, I think it's great, fun, and it has a cool vibe to it. So congratulations, Connie, good job. Hi, my name is Jennifer Tanabe, and I'm creative director and partner at Wall to Wall Studios, which is a branding and advertising company here in Honolulu. Uh, some of my clients at Wall to Wall include the Surf Jack Hotel and Swim Club, Hawaii National Bank, and Kaiser Permanente. My judge's choice selection is from the category of special event material, and my selection is called Solar Eclipse by Isabel Terry from Honolulu High School. And the reason that I selected this as my judge's choice was that I was immediately drawn to the visuals, um, the colors, and the really graphic nature of the work. Um, I love the simplicity of the type treatment and the combination, again, of the colors and the visuals um, gave the pieces um, a feel of being both modern and retro at the same time. There was just this timeless quality about it. Um, I also really liked that the event materials included these buttons which would be really fun um, souvenirs for anyone who attends the event. Um, I appreciated too that each of the buttons had a slightly different design, but it felt very cohesive as a system. So congratulations, Isabel, nice work. My name is Vanessa Katz Zachariah. My title is freelance art director and graphic designer. I work for companies like Anthology Marketing Group, Core Group One, and Malaria No More. Um, my judge's choice was an editorial spread by a student named Connie Wong. She goes to Moanalua High School, um, and it's called How to Relax. I chose this piece because I just thought it was such a fun, young, hip, Instagram-y worthy um, layout. I love the fonts she chose as well as the colors. I think she said, did such a great job of layering so many of these fun textures and images and elements. Um, and I just think it's a really great balanced piece from both pages. So great job, Connie. Hello, my name is April Rutherford. I'm the Executive Creative Director for Anthology here in Hawaii. Um, our company clients are Hawaiian Airlines, Hawaii Pacific Health, American Savings Bank, Hemic, Hawaii Gas. My judge's choice is who did this? I love it. Tia Martin from Waianae High School. It's called Dangerously Delicious. And I thought it was wicked. It made me laugh. And I really enjoy looking at it. Um, I love the idea that somebody was so hungry that they, to get the musubi, they um, bit off their own finger, not knowing the difference. The, the zombie, I love the aloha print 
long sleeve shirt and it just has a lot of humor and character and punch to it. So congratulations to Tia Martin. Hi, I'm Noah Tom. I'm here representing uh, Spectrum Kernel. I am the uh, regional production director and I've uh, chosen some from a category of illustration for my uh, judge's choice this year. Uh, it was something that when I saw it, it was uh, jumping out at me and it really kind of made me feel uh, a sense memory of when I was in high school and kind of the stresses that came along with uh, not doing as well as I should be in high school and, and all the stresses that came along with that. And it's this illustration here. It's done by uh, Daisy Deleuze from uh, Honoka'a High School. And it was just a very moving piece. It kind of really felt the pain that the student is going through and all the teachers that are coming at her and the lack of happiness as happiness is being scraped off her notebook there. But this was really, really impressive work and I, I really loved it. And it's my judge's choice. Hi everyone, my name is Brian Watanabe. I'm the creative director of 26 Keys Creative. Um, my clients include Consolidated Theaters, Latour Cafe, Kunho and Kamehameha Schools, and uh, I do freelance for a lot of uh, ad agencies around town as a copywriter. So my Judges' Choice Award is uh, in the illustration category, and here it is. It's called We Choose to Go to the Moon by Naya Lum. And um, what I love about this, besides it, it's very beautifully illustrated, lots of nice colors, is the big idea, the concept behind this, um, and sort of this use of space. It's um, three murals on three floors. And on the first floor, we choose to go to the moon. Second floor, not because it's easy. And the third floor, when you're out of breath, trying to catch your breath on the third floor, but because it is hard. And I thought this was just a really smart concept um, going along with this uh, really nice artwork. And uh, yeah, congratulations, man. It's a great idea. Hi, my name is Ashley Smith. I'm a commercial photographer represented by Kinetic Productions. I also own Ashley Smith Photo and Hawaii Pet Portraits, where I do um, portraits of people and pets and their people in my studio. Um, my Judges' Choice Award is this black and white photo from Emily Castillo. Uh, she's from Lilihua High School and her photo is entitled Polly Wins. Um, I really love this photo because I felt like um, it's the childhood of today where everybody went to the Polly at one point. Um, her hair is flying. It's a great black and white because the lighting on the two girls kind of highlight them, so my face, my, my eyes go straight to them. What really made it for me was she's holding a phone and she's doing a selfie. So I feel like this is so representative of what um, childhood is today. Hi, this is Rick Noyle, commercial photographer. I have a lot of really great clients, both from Hawaii and abroad. Um, I like shooting fashion, people, and product, and a lot of resort photography. Um, I'm really happy to be judging here today, and I think that from what we've seen, from all the judges, we've seen incredible images. Um, the array of quality from students is exceptional, and uh, we had a really tough time selecting images. So if you submitted a picture, congratulations. And for those who won, really good work, no easy mission. Today, I picked the shot that I really liked from Erica Titus. Here it is. This is just an interesting image for me. It's of a, a really interesting thing, which is a social problem for all of us to deal with today, that we see. And Erica went out and found a nice camera angle and created something that I think had a powerful message for all of us. I like the fact that the fact she's low down, right into it, with the man's shoes in the foreground, very, very nicely composed and good composition across the board. I think Erica really is really like a historian, which we all are as photographers, and um, we record life, and that's what I encourage other photographers to do. There's so many things about family, our social life, and things that we see and enjoy, so I would encourage everybody to get out there, shoot loose, and edit tight. Thank you. Hi, my name is John Hook. I am the photography director for Nella Media Group. Uh, my Judge's Choice Award came from the Single Color Photograph um, category, and I chose Alaskan Fog by Andrew Nolan out of Baldwin High School. Um, I really like the picture because I really love the color, um, I love the mood, um, really cool composition. Um, yeah, I really like this photograph, I'd have it in my house. Um, congratulations!
Hi, my name is Brad Shin. I'm a writer and creative director at Was Is Was. Uh, some of my clients are Hui Car Sharing, uh, Hawaii State Federal Credit Union, and the Hawaii Nature Center. My judge's choice is called Labels, and it's from McKinley High School. It was in the category of public service TV, and the students that worked on it, sorry if I mispronounce anybody's names, uh, Jiang Zhuang, Princess Ortaleza, and Cheryl Lynn Obra. The reason why I picked this was really concept, concept, concept. It had a really strong concept, very simple idea, but, but very well executed. And uh, you know, in a 30 second TV spot, you really need to communicate very uh, quickly and succinctly and strongly and make it memorable. Um, and this spot really did it. It, it really rose um, to the top within the category. Uh, the other thing that I think was really nice on the craftsmanship was the sound design. Um, if you listen to the spot, you can hear sort of whispering in the background. And I think that was just a nice touch where they were um, using all the ch you know, channels, whether it's the audio or the visual or the graphics, um, making use of all those um, elements within a TV spot. So congratulations, McKinley High School. Very well done. Excellent spot. Hi, my name is James Serino, and I'm a pretzel maker director at Kinetic Productions and I have uh, clients I work with ad agencies, Anthology, Melissi, all the different agencies in town, work with their clients who are American Savings Bank, Hawaiian Airlines, Hawaiian Electric, and we work with m most of the clients in town, so super grateful to be here. It's a lot, a lot of great, great projects here, and we saw a lot of great videos, a lot of great commercials, uh, a lot of great PSAs, a lot of great animation, but in the end, for me, there was just one project that climbed to the top. And for me, my judge's pick is um, Force Field, and Force Field by Mark Mercado Jr. in the music video category um, from Waipahu High School. So I just thought this piece was just so powerful and so well made. Um, he was able to take all the elements to me of cinema advertising and tell this story that was compelling and interesting and moved well and played to the song right and on every level um, was just really powerful and fabulous so it was a really well well made project congratulations to mark on my judges pick so thank you thank you very much for having us as judges uh, we've really had a good time it was no easy mission to find the right one uh, collectively we struggled we fought a little bit and we agonized over what we couldn't get uh, John kind of nixed some of our pictures, but then we sort of fought back. But we came up with a really interesting image that we all three of us liked. And this is the one. This is Grace Kathman from Lady, uh, Kalaheo High, and she did a really beautiful job. We like this image. There's something about it. I think that everybody would agree it's got something beautiful about it. Photographically, really nice contrast, very interesting, and he looks like a real happy guy. So congratulations to everybody who entered, and especially to those who won. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thanks. So it was really a tough choice because there are a lot of great, great projects in the broadcast category. But we felt really strongly that there was one project that rose to the top. And our pick for the best of show in the broadcast category is Lipstick. So we just thought this was really, really well done. It was made by Miley, Mark, Marielle, and Kael. And they are from Waipapu High School. So we just thought that this was just a great project, well done in every possible way, and I'm gonna let the guys talk a little bit about what they liked about it. Well, I think in addition to just having a really strong story, you could tell um, that the craftsmanship was there. I mean, the shot angles and the moves and um, the different elements in the spot, they all supported the story. So, um, so very, very well done and very well executed. Yeah, I liked how every shot was intentional. It was uh, very well paced. Um, you left the viewer wanting more. Uh, it didn't feel long at all, which is great, which is what you kind of want the viewer to have. You, you want them wanting more at the end of it. So yeah. that's what I like. And it was just overall just a very, very, very well-crafted piece. We were compelled by it. We were moved by it. I think they took a strong subject matter and really, really communicated really strongly with it. Um, so it was just overall wonderful piece. For us, our best of show and broadcast is lipstick, so congratulations to all of you. Well done.
Great job. Well done. Great job. So we've given, been given the uh, very difficult job of picking best of show out of all of these amazing entries uh, that we saw uh, and some things that we didn't get to really initially vote on, but we are here and we are doing the final voting on all the Judges Choice Awards and one of those is going to become best of show. And uh, throughout all the categories, they, there was such amazing work and there was things we were discussing for many, many minutes through trying to figure out uh, what was going to rise to the top and what ended up uh, coming up was uh, this logo design that we saw and it's from uh, dun, 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 dun. and this is from Jillian Ped, a uh, logo for Foxy Fresh and she's from Maui High. And what I think what um, we really loved about it is that it, it's a conceptual logo so the Foxy Fresh um, it's a fox made out of different fruits for the ears, the nose, the cherries for the eyes. Uh, the colors are really juicy and uh, tantalizing. It, it feels like fresh fruit. And it's just, uh, I think it just caught all of our eyes uh, when we saw it out on the table. Um, and, you know, it was just kind of an instinctual thing, but it was also a very close call. Um, but this is a very polished piece of work, um, and we think it deserves best of show. Congratulations. Congratulations. Congratulations to all our high school students and educators who help and guide them.